So I'm just gonna put on my gloves and we're gonna mix the soils together. Actually, we're gonna mix the soil with this fertilizer. And we, of course, pick the organic. We had the organic garden soil. And we have the organic fertilizer. We'll mix our fertilizer and our soil in this big bucket. And we will add our plants to our fabric bag. This is a root pouch. It allows the plants to grow directly in there. It's made out of nice fibers that allow the roots to breathe prevents overwatering and we'll just get started and see if we can get our plants to grow and thrive in these root pouches or grow bags they do have handles can move them around these plants need about six to eight hours of direct sunlight per day. So if you're in an area that doesn't get that direct light, you can always take these handles and move the bags to a much sunnier area in your yard or on your patio. So we're just gonna mix these together. Create a nice mixture for our plants. Start with the blueberry plant.
now we're going to add our fertilizer. Just gonna mix it up. Now we're gonna take one of our bags and we'll put some of the dirt in it and flatten it on the bottom. And this is our blueberry plant. We're going to take it out of its bucket and put it directly into the bag. We're gonna actually put a little bit more dirt in here and we're gonna add some Epsom salt because apparently blueberries, blueberry plants need, I believe it's magnesium and the Epsom salt does provide that. So we just need to add a bit more dirt Epsom salt around the plant. Put the plant back in there and we'll add the salt and then add the, more, the rest of the dirt to finish it out. So we have our Epsom salt. We're just going to put about a teaspoon or a tablespoon in them and yes it is the magnesium that this will help with. Actually I think this is for the mag this Epsom salt is actually for the tomatoes so we're not going to put that in. For the blueberries, we're just gonna add a bit more fertilizer than we normally would because they do need an acidic soil base. So we're just gonna add a little bit more, a bit more fertilizer to this. And the extra amounts of fertilizer should make for a good acid base. And then we'll just fill it in with dirt. Thank you. 
Now we're gonna set this grow bag for the tomato. We have the big boy tomato and we have Roma tomato. So I'm gonna plant one in each bag. We'll start with the big boy. We'll add in some of the Epsom salt. We'll add some more dirt and then we'll put the plant in. First I'm just going to blend some of the salt and dirt mixture together. I am going to put some water in the bottom of this bag. And then we'll put the plant in. And we'll just loosen the roots a little bit. Actually, we're just gonna put three in each bag. So I'm gonna need to put some more dirt in here. Just adding a bit more salt to the dirt and we're going to mix this together.
These last two bags are gonna hold the remaining six tomato plants, the Roma tomatoes and what's the other one called? The big boy. Now we're gonna add our last six tomato plants, starting with the Roma tomatoes. So we have three more. We're gonna put one here. And we'll take these other two. Put one over here. And the third one here. And now we'll put our other three big boys on this side. here, one here, and one here. And now we're just gonna water everything. We'll put them together against this, against the house, and then we'll water them 